Breaking news! This Halloween is gonna be pretty spooky. Boo! Did I scare you? Anyways, there are people running around on the streets, screaming Ooga Booga and other crazy phrases. We do not know the origin of this phrase or what caused this crazy movement, but we will update you as we find out. Stay safe this Halloween! Boo! Dang, I thought I'd get you that time. Doesn't this kind of thing happen like every year? Like first a few years ago, there were the killer clowns and then now this? Like, isn't it kind of normal at this point? Whoa! Uh, hi, Dad. Well, hey, Junior! I was just trying to scare you. Did I get you, bud? Uh, sure. Anyways, what's up, Dad? Well, you know, Halloween's coming up in a week, and you don't really have a costume yet, so I was wondering if you wanted to go Halloween costume shopping with me so I can get you a costume, and maybe I can even get myself a costume. Oh, that'd be so cool. Be like a throwback, because I haven't trick-or-treated in years, so... Honestly, it'd be fun to dress up again, so what do you think? You want to go costume shopping? Hmm, yeah, costume shopping would be a lot of fun, but I haven't really decided what I want to be yet. Oh, huh, well, all right, let's think of an idea right now. So, what are you thinking? Hmm, well, I'm thinking something like an animal, like <gasps> maybe a really cool animal, like <gasps> a cow. But Junior, cows aren't scary. People are just going to make fun of you. They're just going to see you and be like, Oh, you're a cow, you're fat, that's why you're dressed up as a cow, stupid. What? Dad, you just called me fat. That was me. Well, no, no, I was making up an example. Well, yeah, but you still came up with it, so you just called me fat, Dad. That's mean. Well, no, I, uh, <sighs> whatever. Let's just get off this topic already. Anyways, a cow's not a good idea, Junior. You gotta get a scary costume, okay? It's Halloween. You gotta dress up as something scary. Don't be like one of those kids that dresses up as, like, Spongebob or something. You gotta dress up as something scary. Well, what scary things are you thinking of? Hmm, well, a scary animal. What can I think? <gasps> you could dress up as a scarecrow! Dad, a scarecrow's not an animal. Oh, yeah, you're right. Well, um, I don't know. Dress up as, like, a werewolf or a tiger or something. Just, you know, a scary animal for Halloween, because, you know, you can't have, like, a silly costume. You gotta be threatening. Well, why do I have to be threatening? Well, honestly, Junior, it's a trick, okay? Now, I'm gonna explain to you a story from my childhood, okay? Because you can get more candy if you have a scary costume. Wait, really? Yep, let me explain. Okay, so when I was 11 years old, it was Halloween, and guess what I dressed up as? What? A scary clown. You dress up as a clown? Yeah, yeah, but okay, get this, right? It's not just your typical scary clown costume. This one was completely decked out. It had makeup, it had blood, it had scars, it had everything. It was a completely convincing clown and more. It was scary, it was terrifying, it was everything. Wow, that sounds crazy, Dad. Mm-hmm, and guess what? With the combination of my scary costume and me being able to go, Rawr! you know, with me being able to scream and stuff because I have a strong voice, because of that, you could assume that I got a lot of candy that year, and I was the most popular kid in school, and I gave away candy to people, and then by the end of November, I, I lost all my candy because I gave it all away. That's the only reason I was popular, so just don't give away your candy. You get it now? Hmm. Yeah, I guess I do get it now. You know, having a scary costume, I guess, makes sense to get more candy. Well, yeah, because they feel really threatened, and they want you to get out of their face as soon as possible. It's a perfect strategy. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, I'll go with the tiger costume then, Dad. All right, let me just go to my laptop and I'll buy it for you. All right. W wait, I, I thought we were going costume shopping. Well, on second thought, I don't really want to drive. I'm kind of lazy, so I'm just going to go order from Amazon. All right, Dad. Oh, man, this is going to be so awesome. I'm going to have such an awesome tiger costume. I'm going to be able to go like, meow, meow. it's going to be so cool. Oh, my God. Hey, Junior. Uh, what? Well, uh, oh, sorry to interrupt your sleep, but anyways, me and Luigi were wondering if you wanted to have fun. Uh, what do you mean by that? Well, Junior, tonight is boys' night, meaning that we're all gonna sneak out and have fun. Are you down? Boys' night? Hmm. You know what? Sure, I'll come. All right, sweet. Meet me at the back door. All right, Junior, be sure to shut the door quietly on the way out. Yeah, you don't want Bowser finding out about what we're doing. Okay. I got you guys. So, what exactly are we doing? Well, like I said, Junior, it's boys' night, which means that, you know, we're all just kind of by ourselves, we're taking walks and stuff. It's pretty chill. Yeah, and sometimes if you get lucky, you might even find an animal. Although, if you find a wolf, don't pet it. That's kind of unsanitary. It can also be kind of dangerous. Hmm. Well, okay, this sounds pretty fun. Let's go. Well, junior, be quiet. Well, oh, sorry, I forgot. All right, let's go, guys. All right, guys, we've gotten far enough from the house to where we can start talking normally again. So, there's only one rule to boys' night, which is stay with each other, okay? If we lose one another, then we never know what happened to you. You might die or something, because, you know, you don't know your way home. Well, I know my way home. It's, uh, that way. Oh, wait, there's nothing over there. Exactly my point. So, we have to stick with each other, all right? Now, what's the first thing that we're gonna do tonight? This is gonna be so insane. Oh, look at this tree, Mario. Luigi, why would I care about a tree? Oh, you know, trees are pretty cool. You know, they got, like, branches, and they got, like, more branches, and they got, like, leaves, and sometimes even spiky leaves. And if you try and sit on it, it hurts a lot. Let's try it. 
Yeah, this is kind of why I brought you with us, Junior. Luigi kind of sucks at boys' night. Well, hey, I don't suck at boys' night. How can I suck at boys' night? I didn't do anything wrong. Luigi, your number one priority is to not get caught. You know about the neighborhood security? They have a curfew. We're not supposed to be out past eight. So we have to be stealthy, and we have to hide, and we have to do everything possible to not get caught. That's another thing for you too, Junior. We're not supposed to get caught. Huh, well, that is pretty interesting to know. I mean, I've never actually been outside this late, so I didn't even know they had a curfew, but... Yeah, I guess that does make it pretty interesting. And pretty fun, you know, the thrill and stuff. <laughs> yeah, the thrill of being Hunter really gets your blood going. That's kind of why we do this to begin with. Yeah, it gets really intense sometimes. Right on, Luigi. So, Junior, where else do you think we should... Junior? Uh, Junior? Junior! Ah! What? What are you staring at? Uh... The stars. The stars, Junior? There's barely any stars out! Oh yeah, I guess you're right. Anyway, since you're new here, we're gonna make you the captain today. So, what do you think we should go first? Hmm... Oh, uh, well... I don't know, guys. I guess we should just keep walking a straight path till we find something. Let, let's just go. Okay, I don't know why you're in a hurry, but... Alright, whatever. Let's go, Luigi. It's straight. Hmm... We've never done that before. Junior must be a natural at this. Uh, okay, well we found our street street lamp, so we haven't actually gone that far. Hmm, you know, I've always been kind of curious about this street lamp. I wonder what it tastes like. <laughs> hmm, kind of tastes like blue raspberry. Hey Junior, what do you think? Junior? Oh god, not this crap again. Man, you'll go help him. Uh, dude? Hello? Luigi, is something wrong with Junior? Yeah, honestly, that's what I keep wondering. He keeps on staring up there, which all I'm seeing is the moon. But what's so interesting about the moon? It's just a crescent. Yeah, this doesn't make sense. J Junior! Bro, snap out of it! Ah, don't hurt me! W what? Uh, oh, hey Mario, um, sorry. I don't, I don't know, there's something wrong with me tonight. I I'm seeing things, okay? You're seeing things? Yeah, I'm seeing really weird things. What are you seeing? Well, I'm hearing the moon talk to me. Bro, what? Junior, you do realize that the moon can't talk, right? I'm being serious, guys. This is why I didn't want to tell you, because I knew you wouldn't believe me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, Junior, chill. We believe you. But how are you hearing the moon talk? What does that even mean? Well, he's speaking to me. He's saying things like, you're next, Junior. And then he just, like, glitches. Like, I've never seen anything like that before. I've never even heard the moon talk to me to begin with. What's going on? Uh, well, I don't know how to break this to you, Junior, but... I'm not really seeing that. Luigi, are you seeing that? Nope. The moon's not talking. This just sounds like crazy talk to me. You see, guys, this is exactly why I didn't want to tell you. I knew you guys would just call me crazy, say I'm doing crazy talk, say I'm being weird, and then you would just make fun of me the whole entire time. Uh, oh my god. Oh my god, guys. But what? What's going on, Junior? Why would it matter to you? You don't even believe me anyway, but... Guys, I think the moon's changing me. Junior, I swear to God, you're the most stupid person on the entire planet. No, no, Luigi, this seems serious. J Junior, what is going on? Uh, well, I don't know why, but I feel like the more I stare at the moon, the, the more I feel weird. So just stop staring at the moon then? I really don't see what's so complicated about this. Well, I'm trying, but I just can't stop. It's... Oh my god, I already feel like I'm changing! Junior, I don't know what's going on, okay? But I'm sorry for not believing you at first, okay? I don't really know what's going on, but I hope you know that we're here and it's all gonna be okay, alright? No, Mario, I don't think I'm gonna be okay. This isn't just your average crazy situation. This is a super crazy situation. Wait, now I'm actually concerned. Junior, are you okay? <sighs> 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 What in the world? <sighs> Luigi, are you seeing this? Yep, yep I am, Madio. I swear, every day just gets crazier. <sighs> <sighs> Luigi? Run. <gasps> <gasps> Luigi, keep running! Don't stop! <laughs> okay, Madio, I got you! Oh my god! <sighs> Mm. Ah! Oh no! Man, you keep going! Just hurry, Luigi! I'll get the door! Mm. Mm. Quick, Luigi, get in! Mm. Ah! Quick, close the door! Close the door! Mm. Ah. 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 Phew! That was close. Yeah, we were so close to getting ripped up out there, you have no idea, but we closed the door so we can't get back in. Come on, Luigi, let's go back upstairs. Okay! Oh god, this is a mess. Mm. Mm. <sighs> uh. 
Luigi, what are you doing? <laughs> nothing, Medio. I'm just scared, that's all. Luigi, we already locked Junior out of the house. We have nothing to worry about. We're safe. Well, yeah, but that's not what I'm concerned about. I'm concerned about him. Well, what about him? Medio, he could still be a werewolf and we don't even know. Okay, then. Well, then let's just go check. Well, what do you mean by check? I mean, let's just look out the window and see if he's still out there. Oh, phew. For a second there, I thought you meant going outside. Okay, well, let's look then. Oh, no, no. <sighs> All right, time to start off my day. W wait a minute, I forgot. Last night, I was supposed to mow the lawn. I gotta go mow the lawn! <gasps> oh my god, I'm late! <laughs> yep, still a werewolf. Well, what do we do? We gotta help him. Well, I don't know, Luigi. We gotta just kind of wait it out or something. I mean, there's nothing we can really do. You know, maybe it goes away after two days or something. Oh, I really hope that's the case. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> move out of the way, guys! Wait, Bowser, what are you doing? <laughs> I have to mow the lawn because I forgot yesterday. Then move out of the way! Oh, okay, gee. Wait, Bowser, you can't go outside! Oh, well, I have to! Ugh. All right, now I'm outside. Now, where do I leave that lawn mower? <laughs> wait, what? W wait, did they lock me out? Hello? Guys, let me back in! W what? Luigi, it's his responsibility now. We can't let him back in. Well, wait, we're locking him out too? Well, yeah, of course. Well, why him? He didn't do anything wrong. Well, because we can't risk him letting the werewolf back in. I mean, think about it. If he leaves the door open for longer than a second, it's just gonna run in and swoop us all. Mm, I guess. Good luck, Bowser. Guys, come on, I did nothing wrong. All I wanted to do was just come out here, mow the lawn, and then come back inside, and then we... What the heck? <sighs> um... Junior? <laughs> oh, Junior, that is you! Dang, nice costume, man! Uh, dang, Junior, when I said get a scary costume, I didn't think you'd go all out. Like, dang, you got the fangs, the red eyes, the claws, the everything. Wow, you're really good at being a werewolf. Well, guess I'll cancel the odor on the tiger costume. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, Junior, did you just scratch me? Jeez, mm -hmm. uh, that burns. What the heck, Junior? Mm. Uh, I mean, come on. I know you're supposed to be in character, but just snap out of it. This hurts. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute. You're not Junior, are you? Mm -hmm. I mean, Junior wouldn't scratch me even if it was pretend. Mm -hmm. So, you must be possessed or something. Well, whatever beast possessed my son, you know what? You're not so tough. Let's have a brawl right here. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, shoot. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> oh, God. I really shouldn't have challenged a fight with a werewolf. <laughs> oh, God. I can outrun him. I can outrun him, right? <laughs> okay, just gotta make it to the front yard. All right, I'm almost there. <laughs> yes, finally, I'm here. <laughs> All right. Wait, what? The door's locked! Someone let me in! Mm -hmm. Wait, what is that? Oh yeah, I forgot we have a spare can in the doormat! Okay, let me just get this really quick. I have to get in now. Oh, come on, come on, please work! It worked! Okay, I'm safe. Oh, man, I really hope we're safe, Medio. Yeah, me too. This past day has been too crazy. Well, yeah, I mean, Junior turning into a werewolf? That's crazy! Yep, didn't even think that was possible. Yeah, but then again, do you think it was wrong for us to lock him out? Luigi, he transformed into a vicious animal. It's not wrong. We just want to protect ourselves, you know, in case he's dangerous. You know, he's probably not in the right state of mind. Mm, I guess. It's just, he it feels really wrong. I don't know. I feel kind of bad for him. Like, how do you think it even happened? Idiot, we watched it happen. Uh, oh, yeah, we did. <sighs> Oh my god! Well, Bowser, how did you get back in? I used a spare key under the doormat. Oh, okay. But, I have one question. What's up, Bowser? Well... Why did you lock me out of the house? Oh, dang, Bowser, chill! Don't get all loud! No, 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 I'm not gonna chill! You guys locked me out of the house at night time with Junior, who turned into a werewolf somehow! How did that happen? But why would you lock me out? We just want to keep ourselves safe, that's all! So you sacrificed me? No, it wasn't a sacrifice, it's just that we didn't want to let him in, because then if we let Junior in as a werewolf, he's probably gonna just go and eat everyone! Exactly, Luigi. Bowser, we're sorry for locking you out, but it was really for the best. Mm, whatever. Anyways, the house is basically on lockdown, so until we get this whole situation figured out, don't leave the house at all, you understand? Yeah, I guess that makes sense. So, we're gonna have to find a solution to this problem, like how to revert Junior, or at least how to get him neutral with us, or something like that, because we don't know how long this is gonna last. Yeah, that's true, Luigi. We gotta figure out a plan on how to revert Junior. So, what are you guys thinking? What do you guys think we should do? Well, maybe somehow we could talk to the moon, and we could get the moon to, you know, reverse this whole situation, so then Junior won't be a werewolf anymore. 
Luigi, how do you expect us to talk to the moon? Well, you know, you take the moon and you take the sun. You take everything that feels like fun. Bowser, please tell me you have a better idea than this. Hmm. Well, now that I think about it, just give me 10 minutes, guys. I'll be back with a full plan. Wow, 10 minutes? All right. Man, yo, this is going to be awesome. Yeah. Bowser should have a pretty good plan since, you know, Junior's his son. So he must know everything about him. Yeah, that's true. Uh... Madiel, what was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from the... <sighs> uh, Luigi, I don't care what plan Bowser comes up with. We need it. All right, soldiers, get over here. I got my plan all figured out, and it's foolproof. Oh, cool, Bowser, you finished the plan. All right, now let's do it. Okay, so basically, you know how wolves eat animals, right? Yeah. Okay, so basically, you can either use a beaver or a rabbit. If we use a beaver, we can get something that looks like a beaver and use it to distract Junior, and then we strike. Or we can get the rabbit from Peach's castle, you know, the one from Super Mario 64, and then we can lure Junior with it, and again, we can strike. And then, you know, we knock him out, and we tie him up and stuff, we intervene, and then hopefully he switches back from there, and he gets an attitude change. I am fully on board with that rabbit plan. I hate that stupid rabbit. <laughs> yeah, I figured you would be. But man, you remember? Peach doesn't even own the castle anymore, so the rabbit's probably gone by now. Mm, yeah, I guess that's true. Hey, whatever happened to that castle anyway? Uh, man, you, did you really never hear that it caught on fire? Well, fire? How did that happen? I don't know. I think the guy was, like, making a taco or something, and then- Guys, 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 stop getting distracted, okay? We need to focus on the plan. Now, you guys said that the rabbit wouldn't work because you don't have access to the rabbit anymore, right? Because she doesn't have the castle. Right. Okay, so, uh... Hmm, so we're gonna have to stick with the beaver then. So, we need to find something that looks like a beaver. Well, if we're not gonna use an actual beaver, then what are we supposed to use that looks like a beaver? Wh what? You can't be serious. It's only for a few minutes, Luigi. Until we're able to knock out Junior and interrogate him, then you're gonna have to wear the beaver disguise. Well, why does it have to be me of all people? What if he kills me? He's not gonna kill you, Luigi. You just have to run faster than him. Bowser, that doesn't sound very promising. Yeah, exactly, Mario. Bowser, don't make me do this. Come on, Luigi. It'll be simple. Look, all you have to do is just run around the yard while he's chasing you, and then I'll be hiding somewhere, and then I'll sock him. Sock him? Yeah, it's some weird slang we used to use back in the day. Anyways, you got the plan, Luigi? Uh, I guess. But if anything happens to me, I'm suing you. Unless I'm dead. Then, uh, Mario, you sue him for me. Um, okay. Let's just get this over with. Well, all right. Come on, Luigi. Let's go outside. And as for you, Mario, just, uh, watch from the window and don't die. I don't know. Okay, I guess. Uh. Luigi! Huh? Come on! Oh, okay. Hmm. Well, you see anything? Uh, no, I can't see anything. How about you go outside for me and look? Well, no, I can't do that. What if he finds me? Uh, okay, I'll go outside with you. Okay. Hmm. <gasps> oh, there he is! Oh, oh god, this is so terrifying. So what do you want me to do? Well, I thought I already explained this to you. I mean, I know I make him chase me, but what happens after that? Oh, well, basically, I'll just be on that wall, and as soon as you lure him over there, I'll just hit him in the head with one of those bricks. Well, hit him in the head with a brick? You're gonna kill him! <laughs> oh, I spoke too loudly. Oh my god. Uh, so are we going with plan B now? Plan B? There is no plan B, just go! Okay. <laughs> 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 Yes, come to me. <laughs> oh, hey, Bowser, get him! <laughs> so, when do you think he's gonna wake up? I don't know, hopefully sometime soon. <clears throat> oh, hey, Junior, I see that you've woken up. Yeah, must have had such a nice slumber, huh? Well, not anymore. Junior, we need you to come back. <clears throat> You heard him, Junior. Junior, we don't know what's going on or how you even became a werewolf, but we need you to snap out of it, okay? Try everything in your power to snap out. Bowser, do you have anything to say? Oh, do I? Look, Junior, I know I wasn't here for you to turn into a werewolf. I don't even really know when it happened, but however it happened, you need to snap out now, okay? <laughs> I know how this works. Well, not really, but we've been trying to figure out all day how to revert you. And you Wait, won't revert. is he? We need you to at least try, okay? You just keep on coming up and attacking us, and it doesn't make sense. And all we're trying to do is... Uh, B Bowser, he just chewed through the wire. Uh, I can see that. Um, guys? Run! <laughs> <laughs> Bowser, what do we do? Yeah, Bowser, we need a plan quick. Guys, I got this. Hey! <laughs> Ugh, fetch! <laughs> oh, next distraction, Bowser. Huh, thanks. Let's get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Keep following me, guys. I got a plan. <laughs> 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 Hmm. 
Wow, that was close. Yep, perfect hiding spot. No one would think to look in the oven. Although, I do have one problem. I'm too tall to fit. It's okay, Bowser. We're only being here for about hmm, maybe maximum 10 minutes while we just wait for Junior to go back upstairs. Oh my god. I thought you said 10 minutes, Mario. I thought it would be 10 minutes, but I don't know what he's doing. Okay, we need to somehow bail this plan soon. I'm getting kind of tired of being in here. Uh, guys, he turned on the oven. Wait, why? Yeah, what reason does he have to do that? He doesn't even know we're in here. I don't know, but we need to bail. Come on, follow me. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Come on, guys, he's down. <laughs> Come on, Bowser. <gasps> uh, uh, uh. Hmm? Hmm. Uh, ah! Headshot. Uh. <laughs> 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 Okay, guys, I literally don't know what else to do at this point, so do you guys have any other ideas? Hmm, well, how about we find out what else werewolves eat, and then we actually give it to him? You know, not like me dressing up as a beaver, but, you know, if we found an actual beaver, what if we fed it to him? Okay, first of all, that'd kind of be murder, and also, I don't really want to do that, because that'd probably just drag him closer to us. It'd probably just make him want to target us even more, so, Mario, do you have an idea? Uh, well, how about we go to KFC? Wh why? Oh, wait, what? Sorry, I was daydreaming. What are we doing? This is why we're gonna die. Guys, 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 we can't give up hope now. <sighs> why is that? Well, I have one more idea. It involves us going outside and potentially risking my life, but honestly, this could work. Hmm, where is he? Uh, I don't see him. Well, we gotta find him soon. It's important. We need to find him soon, because if we don't find him and we don't fix this whole mess, then we're going to be stuck with this forever. Uh, hey, Junior. <laughs> Wait, why isn't he going up to you guys? Uh, oh, shoot. Luigi, I think he still thinks you're the beaver. <laughs> Hey, Bells, you want to make some bets? Uh, sure. I bet $500 that Luigi's going to win. <laughs> Terrible choice, Bowser. I bet $500 that the werewolf is going to win. Let's find out. Uh, uh, all right. Here's where the plan comes into action. Mm. Mm. Uh, please don't hurt me. Mm. Mm. Ah, please. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm. Mm. Uh, all right. Here we go. Ah, mm. And... Uh, how? How? Well, Mario, you owe me. <sighs> Dang it. I'll just give it to you when we get back in the house. Uh, wh wait, what? Where am I? What day is it? That worked? That actually worked? How? What worked? Uh, nothing, nothing. Let's just go back inside. Okay. So yeah, basically you turned into a werewolf and you were haunting us. Oh, huh. dang. Well, that sounds really cool. No, it wasn't cool at all, Junior. It was terrifying. Oh, well, maybe from my perspective, it could have been pretty cool, but I wasn't able to control any of it. All I remember is just blacking out. Did two days really pass? Yep, lasted for two whole days. Two very long and tiring days. Wow. Well, uh, thanks for saving me, I guess. Yeah, no problem. Anything for our friends. Wait, so that wasn't your Halloween costume? Uh, no. Dang it, I canceled the order for nothing!